What's up guys? I'm back out here doing some more <laughs> some more squirrel hunting. Um it's early morning. Got my ball. I'm using the bow again. So there's there's two squirrels right here. And I saw one right over there. <gasps> Sorry, I'm kinda sick. What's up guys, right now, I'm just sitting on this log, uh, waiting for squirrels to come in. There actually hasn't been a whole lot of activity, I've, I've seen for sure two squirrels, a really big one, and, um, a little one that I was trying to get, but the camera wouldn't turn on, so, I couldn't get him, and I wasn't just gonna shoot him off camera. But, uh, yeah, I, I did see a, a chipmunk, too, but, uh, they're illegal to hunt, only if they're being pesky, and they're, they're not being pesky out here, and so I don't think I'd eat them anyway. They're, they're tiny, there's nothing on them. But I, I also saw, like, three other squirrels up in trees, moving them around and grabbing nuts and stuff. I saw them all over there, so... I think if I don't see anything sitting here, I'm kind of just sitting, taking a break because I've been walking around for a while. But, uh, yeah, I might just get up and head back to that spot because that's where I saw the squirrels. So, hopefully, we can get something and, uh, stay tuned.
All right, you guys saw what just happened. I just shot a squirrel with the bow. I, this one, I was like chasing him around all over through here, and uh, I couldn't get the camera rolling on him. I did, as you guys could see, a couple times, and even drew back on him, but then he would just get up and move away. And so finally, I just decided I'd go after him and just film with the GoPro. I took it off. Um, but I shot him the first time with some new tips that I'm using. And I guess it wouldn't really matter anyway, but I'll show you what they are. But I shot him in the front leg, and it went, like, right through him or something. My arrow's gone, so, man, this I hate losing arrows, but I don't know. What do you do? That's just as long as I got the squirrel, but um, <laughs> here he is. Um, here he is right here. I shot him, well, if you guys don't like blood, there's lots of blood on the squirrel, so. I shot him right there with the thumper tip, and as you can see, that was not a good shot at all. And then he ran up the tree and stopped, and I shot him right there in the head. Oh my gosh, that's a lot of blood. And I actually shot him with that same judo tip that I shot all those other squirrels with. It is so messed up and yet it kills them so fast. I mean, yeah, these judo tips are as cheap as crap, but I mean, if they keep putting the squirrels down, I'll keep using them. I'll show you guys real quick. Um, the other tips that I got, which I don't know, the judos actually might work better, but here they are. They're these, I don't know what brand they are. I know they're not VPAs or anything like that, but you can see they're, they're just these little thumpers. Um, they do have a little point inside, and on each of these, you can see there's one, two, three, four. They've got a little edge on them, so they did, um, they did cut the squirrel open and went right through. And, uh, so my arrow's gone somewhere, so... The plan is we're gonna um, we're gonna I don't know put this squirrel in the bag, clean off my arrow, get everything set up, and then I'm just gonna like go over there and trace my steps, retrace my steps, and see if I can find that arrow. If I can't, it's not a big deal, but I hate losing arrows, so. Um, <sighs> finally got one it's been quite a while but i just walked down here i knew there'd still be one around this area he's not a big squirrel i i'm thinking these squirrels that i've been shooting might be born this year because they're not super big um and they they act pretty dumb like i saw a big one this morning and when he saw me he just booked it so let's see if we can find the arrow clean the stuff up uh bag this squirrel and uh keep on hunting so I couldn't ever end up finding that arrow I'm not sure where it went um, I rewatched the footage and it looks like it just <laughs> kept on going um, even though it was a thumper tip and it's supposed to stop when it hits something um, how's it gonna stop when it barely scrat you know barely rips open a squirrel's arm it's gone so yeah, I hate losing arrows, and, uh, I mean, there went some money, the night, you know, that tip and the arrow, but, I don't know, uh, at least I got the squirrel, so, um, but yeah, I bagged the squirrel, cleaned off the arrow, there's so much blood, um, so, we're gonna try and get some more, hopefully, they're, they're kind of, they're not really out very much today, so, kind of surprising I really thought there'd be a lot more just everywhere because last night it, well yesterday it rained all day which kind of kept them in their nests and stuff and it's super clear out today and sunny and nice it's not too hot especially here in the shade so they I don't know I, I'd think they'd be out you know um, but I'm not a squirrel wizard so Hopefully we can get another one, and uh, hopefully we'll be on this camera, so stay tuned. 
Well, we've got a deer down there. There's a fawn right next to her. Yeah, like, right down there. Oh, look at that cute little fawn. Alright guys, so as y'all know, we ended up getting one squirrel. I would have liked to have gotten more, but I guess it's better than nothing. We did lose an arrow, which really sucks, um, because I hate losing arrows, you know. Got another kill on the bow, and if you guys are wondering what kind of bow this is, it's the G5 Quest Forge, and in a couple videos ago, I did do a review on it, so if you want to know more about it, go check that video out. We got one squirrel for lunch. Not really a meal, but you'll eat. Also, um, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please like and subscribe, and stay tuned for more videos, and we'll see you guys next time.